Hi everybody, I'm really excited about today's show on Everything Home TV. I bought these probably about six months ago. They're both Headlight Restore systems. One's HeadlightRestore.us. We got this one online. And then this one is by Armorall. They're about the same price. Uh, my headlights look terrible on one of our work trucks. It's an old 93 truck. So we're going to try to see which one of these works best. Let's go get started. Okay, so here's the headlight and actually the turn signal. We're going to do both of these. Uh, put some tape down here so that we can keep the center part with nothing on it so we can kind of compare the two to how it looked before down the middle. And you're not going to find headlights that are too much worse than this. So we're going to follow each one's instructions. We're going to do the armor all on the left hand side and then do the restore, the headlight restore US on the right side over here. So the first thing that uh, you're supposed to do is actually we're, we clean these with uh, soap and water to get all the bugs off and everything and they're completely dry so now we're going to put on Headlight Restore. This is their cleaning and oxidation one so let's get that unfolded. start cleaning this off now we're not too worried about this truck but if you've got painted surfaces around the headlights then you want to tape that off so you don't get this on the painted surfaces so it says to kind of move the towel around a little bit now this is all supposed to only take about two minutes so it should be less than four minutes now this one says once you've used this to make sure that it's dry with a paper towel. So we're going to dry this one off. Now it says that it's going to be a little hazy after you've done this. So we're done with that one. Let's do the armor all. Step one on the armor all is the same thing. It's a cleaning wipe. So that's what it comes in. Let's get this started on this side. And this one says the same thing. If you're doing it around painted surfaces, plastic surfaces, besides the headlights to uh, make sure you tape it off to not get it on it. And it says keep rotating this around until you don't see a lot of oxidation coming off on it. Same thing with this one. Make sure it's all dried off. Then the next step on this headlight restore, the number two, which is the protection layer. Let's open this up. This goes right on. And do the protection layer down here too. Then 
we're going to do step two, the UV sealant protector for the armor all. So just wipe it on kind of like you're painting. Now both of these say on the directions that they need to dry for a couple hours. Uh, don't wash your car for at least 24 hours. And if they get wet, then what you're going to need to do is repeat the step one and two and redo it. So we're going to come back in a couple hours after these dry and then pull this off and see how it looks. Okay, see so it hasn't quite been two hours, but I'm anxious to pull off this tape and see which one did better. So we did the Headlight Restore US on the right side and the Armor All Ultra Shine on the left. So let's take our tape and pull this off. So obviously, big difference what they used to be obviously they're not completely clear but uh, like I said you're not going to find lights that were in this bad of condition uh, but I'm have to say by looking at them real close man they are they're almost equal I think the uh, armor all looks almost a little bit clearer than the other one but they, they are both pretty equal on that. So I'd say that both are a good value for the price.